Hello and welcome to another reading of Boy Parts, my debut novel, which is out on July 23rd. Um, I'm reading from a scene which takes place in a nightclub. The context necessary for you is that um, the protagonist, Irina, has been taking cocaine all night and her best friend, Flo, has specifically said that she does not want to take any cocaine for moral and, I don't know, I guess just hangover reasons. Um, I drag Flo back inside where they hoot and clap because David Bowie is playing. The DJ knows his audience very well. I scowl. You've got a face like a smacked arse, Rini. What? I said, you've got a face like a smacked arse. It's just, there's a lot of white people in here acting like they don't know they're white people, but they are and they look stupid. What? I'm going for a piss. Flo follows me. She makes a beeline for her own stall, but I grab her by the wrist. Flo, I say, hey Flo. And I beckon her into the stall. Step into my office. What? Step into my office. Business meeting, I say. She comes in and I slam the door shut behind her and lock it. You'll be wanting a line then. It's a tight squeeze. There's a lot of woman for such a small space. I'm crouched by the toilet. The floor is a bit wet and sprinkling coke on the seat, chopping and pushing and fixing it into lines with my national insurance card, which is always my card of choice. My mum found it on the floor of my house once and said, why is your NI card here? And there's no explanation for that really, no legitimate reason it could possibly be there. Like, yeah, I just leave it on the floor. That's just where it lives, ma'am, on the floor. Put it back, I'll lose it. I go on then, says Flo. Flo wants a line of coke, of course. Flo wants a line of coke. Do you have a note? She does. She has a fiver. I feel safer with the plastic money. I feel less like I'm gonna get hepatitis. Cashing up at work with paper money. You feel like you could shake off the notes and salvage a bump at least. Plastic money though, it just bounces off. And if you have a nosebleed, it's not like you've ruined a note, you can just rinse it off. I make Flo go first because she has the note. And I watch her hoover up that line like the sesh gremlin I know she really is. You know, fuck morals, fuck ethical drug consumption. What's that fucking bit in train spotting from the posters, you know, from everyone's room when they're 16? You know, choose life, choose a job and all that shit. Well, choose fucking up. Choose to come into my office and take cocaine because I told you to. Choose to follow me back out to the bar after we've had a line and drink a shot of tequila. The thing with Flo, with a lot of people our age, She's so fucking quick to blame everyone else for our shit, you know? And you do choose these things. You choose to make yourself feel like an absolute fucking spineless, easily led piece of shit with a steam and hangover tomorrow morning. Maybe even tomorrow mean. Maybe even tomorrow evening. You know, the night is young and I have so much cocaine in my bra. I realise I forgot to piss.